Hey, welcome back guys. So today on this video, we are talking about your zero account and more specifically, I'm going to quickly answer a question I keep getting a lot on my other video. And that is how do you link or connect your Stripe account to your zero account? So let's go ahead and talk about this. First off guys, real quick video, not too many steps involved. So be sure to stick around to the end of the video, but why would you want to link your Stripe to your zero account anyways? Well, that's pretty easy. If you're running an online business, you know that chasing down your customers to get paid is kind of an annoying thing. So if you can make it easy and let them pay with a credit card directly from your invoice, it can help avoid some of that runaround. And with zero, you can do that by adding your Stripe account. Whatever the case is, it's a pretty easy process. It's handled here in your zero dashboard. Check my video description. I'll try to leave the written instructions there as well, but I've already logged into my zero account and this is the home screen. Now here on the home screen, if you want to link your Stripe account, what you're going to do is click on your company name here on the top left. Once you do that, make sure that you're working in the correct organization. If you have more than one organization, I just have this one. So what you're going to do next is click on settings. Okay. Once you click on settings, you'll see these two drop down menus, but you want to look for this button here called payment services. Okay. So once you do that, you're going to get this payment screen on your zero. So what you can do is just scroll to the bottom and then you're going to see these few different options, but you want to look for this one that says Stripe right here. Uh, go ahead and click on add Stripe account. Okay. Next in order to connect your Stripe to zero, you want to click here, add information. Okay. Next Stripe is going to open up a browser. And what you want to do is go ahead and enter in the email address that you have associated with your Stripe account. If you don't have a Stripe account, go back and watch my other video that describes that process in detail on opening up a new Stripe account. So for me, I'm going to go ahead and log in with my email right here. Okay. Once you enter in the email address that's associated with your Stripe account, go ahead and click on submit. Okay. Next Stripe is asking me to enter in my password to my Stripe account, not my zero account. So I'm going to go ahead and enter my password in off screen. Okay. I entered my password. I'm going to click submit. Okay. Stripe just sent me a text message verification to make sure that it is me that's trying to connect my zero to my Stripe. So I'm going to enter that authorization code in here. Okay. Next zero is asking me if I want to go ahead and use my account information from Stripe right here. So I'm going to go ahead and use that one right here and then click on continue. Okay. Next in order to accept credit cards using Stripe, they're going to ask some questions about how you use your zero account for invoicing. So first you want to go ahead and put your website. Okay. So this is the first time I've ever seen this, but they're asking me if I want to go ahead and contribute to Stripe climate, something about climate change. I'm going to go ahead and omit that. So I'm going to say no, thanks. Okay. Next they're showing me all of the data that I have connected in my Stripe account. So my name, my address, my phone number, my website, all of that information. So just make sure that it's all correct because this would be verified since you're going to be accepting credit cards through zero using Stripe. And if so, go ahead and click on agree and submit. Okay. Now they're asking what account I'm going to be using for payment. So let me go ahead and just choose my chase account and click on continue. Okay. A quick second later, I get this pop-up saying my Stripe is now connected to my zero account. So now a pay now button, if you look right here has been added to all of my invoices. So now my customers can easily receive their invoice and then click on it and pay with their credit card. So let me go ahead and close this out. Okay. A quick second later, the page refreshes. Now you can see that my Stripe for cards is connected, but also automatically I can accept payments by wallet. So Apple pay, Google pay and link. So Stripe already turned that on. Now, if you want to go ahead and connect the bank transfer option, you can go ahead and turn that on right here as well. I'm not going to do that because I don't really want to receive any ACH payments. So there you have it, guys. If you're wondering how to link or connect your Stripe account to your zero account, that's the easiest way I know how to do it. If you know an easier way, be sure to leave a comment below. Let the rest of us know how you did it. Hopefully you found that video useful. If so, click thumbs up or maybe consider subscribing to my channel and I hope to see you on the next video. Thanks again for watching.